Star Scorecard Cheat Code 5.4F, super similar to our last Teak 5.4E. Parentheses introduce, right, simplify numerical expressions. It's, it's the same type of problems, but the, the problems are going to be more broad, okay? You have to know your order of operations. And there's going to be two videos for this Teak, uh, for this cheat code. So go over the vocab, same vocab as 5.4e, order of operations. Please excuse my dear Aunt Sally. Parentheses, exponents, multiply, uh, divide, add, and subtract. Please excuse my dear Aunt Sally. She is crazy. Brackets and parentheses, they're the same thing. They're groupings. Anytime you have a grouping of, of, a, of an operation or numbers, do that grouping first. Okay, equivalent expression. Two expressions that look different. Maybe the numbers are different order or whatever, but they have the same result. They have the same conclusion. They equal the same amount. Simplify to make the expression or equation easier to use. Here are the order of the operations. This is, if you understand this, if you can remember this, you're good. And remember, exponents, we're not worried about exponents because exponents begin in sixth grade. That's next year. And we'll we learn that in like May. Okay, but not right now. All right. Margaret opened a new case of light bulbs. Anytime you have a problem that has all of these bullets, take a deep breath, slow down, and think, okay, one bullet at a time. The case contains three boxes of light bulbs with eight light bulbs in each box. This, three boxes times eight bulbs, right? There's three boxes, eight light bulbs in each box. Margaret threw two of these light bulbs into the trash because they were damaged. Minus two. She threw two away, right? Two were damaged, so she threw them in the trash. So that's like a minus two. Okay, minus two. Then she took seven of the light bulbs out of the case. Okay, so what do we do? So she took seven more. Which expression can we use to show that there are 15 light bulbs still in the case? Okay, so minus seven, this is minus seven again, because she took them out. She took out seven light bulbs out of the case. Three times eight, minus two, minus seven. All right, here it is, H. Why is it, why is it H? Because look, it's confusing because it's plus seven, right? If she took out two and she took out seven, that's like saying she took out nine, right? She took out, um, let me, let's do this. Three times eight is 24. Okay. 24 minus two equals 22. 22 minus seven equals 15. That is what we did up here, right? But if we put a parentheses around the 2 and the 7, watch this. 2 plus 7 is 9. So 24 minus 9 is 15. That's our answer. The answer is 15 light bulbs. Okay? So that's what we have to do. 3 times 8, we know that. And then minus 2 and minus 7, oh, so it's minus 2 plus 7. That's 9. That's our answer. Okay, next problem. Which expression has the value of one? Woof, woof, deep breath. You have to solve all of these. You have to, a lot of scratch work. You have to write your work down on the star test. Use the paper they give you, okay? Your teachers will give you extra paper if you need it. Four, okay, here's, woof. So this has brackets, and a lot of parentheses here. 5 times 2 is 10. 5 times 4 is 20. So then we have the bracket. We still have the grouping. We have to do that next. 10 plus 20 is 30. What is 40 minus 30 equals 10? Does that have a value of 1? No. 5 times 4 is 20. Five to, uh, 4 times 5 is 20. 
Okay, then we have the bracket. What is 20 plus 20? That's 40. So what? Oh, here's our answer. 40 divided by 40. Because 20 plus 20 equals 40. So 40 divided by 40 equals 1. What is 40? How many times does 40 go into 40? One time. So here's our answer. And let's just do this for practice. 5 times 3 is 15. 5 minus 2 is 3. Okay, 15 minus 3 is 12. So that's 12 because we have to do the bracket. After you do the parentheses, parentheses, now you do the bracket. And that's the, when you have a double, that's called a double grouping. You have a grouping within a grouping. One step at a time. Parentheses first, and parentheses, and parentheses. Once you get all of your parentheses done, then you move on. 40 plus 12. 40 plus 12 equals 52. That's not it. All right, so this is 15 minus 10. And then here's our bracket. So that's 5. 40 times 5 is 0, 200. Okay, not it. Guys, this is the video. Tune into the next video for, for the next set of questions. Thanks so much.